we are day six and today is Monday and it's Memorial Day so we're staying away from the park looked online on social media this morning and the queues to get in Universal are pretty bad out there yeah, the ride waits itself has been like 10 15 minutes on some stuff yeah it says on the app yeah like Amy just said 10 15 minutes for a ride the queue and then some veterans might be in service isn't they? true but um it's an unreal tally to be honest with you but uh so what we're going to do today well this morning um sarah's sorting out the washing bless her so it's a wash day we're going to just chill by the pool until we get bored and then we've got a table booked for one of our favorite restaurants cafe 22 tango so when, me and Sarah went there last September and absolutely loved it. So we've got that booked through, I think what, no, four, four o'clock, I think. And um, then we'll take it from there, see what happens this evening. Might just walk down International Drive and check out some of the bars there. And then tomorrow, hopefully, we're going to do Volcano Bay. But um, at the moment, chill time. Say chill time. Chill time. Chill time. We just threw it on sand yeah. though. <laughs> just throw that chill. Literally, <laughs> lifeguard has just blown the whistle, swimming off like hell, and next thing he's pulling a child out. I nearly jumped in. Everybody's panicking. They never said it's a practice. And all of a sudden I heard the, the whistle, so I looked and I see something in the middle. I was like, oh my god. My heart was just like that, and we saw something like that, so I was like, oh my gosh, the little boys. I don't know how the reaction is. Do they drag them out when they get them out? Then they obviously pick them up by the neck and just picked him up by the neck. Yeah, we it by the wrist, and then they just threw it. They just threw it, yeah. So that's it now. Splat marks, like. See the splat marks, they splattered it on the side. Yeah, so I think it's dead, they'll give up now. Just waiting for the water. Waiting for the coroner now. We'll call him Rupert. Right, we're on our way for our reservation at Cafe Two Two Tango. And the smells down International Drive at the moment are amazing. Very spicy. It's probably that place, isn't it? The Brazilian, Brazilian steakhouse. It smells gorgeous. Fogo de Chayo. You found yeah, that smells nice. Maybe look at the reviews for that and somewhere else to try. Cafe 2-2 two, two, Tango. Obviously, we some of you probably have seen, hopefully, in the September vlogs, last September, we did come here. Um, again, we've come during happy hour. So, we'll probably get the sampler again and then take it from there. It's a lot busier than it was the last time we came, but it is Memorial Day, Monday. Unfortunately, with it being the holiday, Memorial, Memorial Day, they're not doing the sampler. But to be honest, I'm not bothered because the main menu itself looks 
just as good and we did intend doing that anyway so we just decided what to order at the minute I can see us coming back anyway during the week and doing the sampler but really do love Cafe Tutu Tango it's just so colourful and all the artwork I mean the artwork is amazing like that one love that one I don't think there is oh there is an artist on yeah there is an artist on as well so we'll have a look at his work later on so that's Sarah's hummus that smells gorgeous and Amy's got the tzatziki with the breads right, Samuel and myself have just tried alligator for the first time so these are the alligator spicy alligator bites See what Samuel does. I'm gonna have to keep talking because we've got copyright music. So what do you think of that? Does it tastes like alligator, chicken eat. I'm gonna have to keep talking. Yeah. I'm not sure how to describe it. Weird. Weird. Is it? I'll try it. Right, I'm gonna have to keep talking. Obviously, copyright music. But, uh, Yeah. Oh, weird. Yeah, it's supposed to taste like chicken, but yeah, it's quite weird, that, isn't it? It's sort of a cross between chicken and prawns. Yeah, I'd have it again, though. Yeah, it's very nice. Yeah, it shows how um, unprofessional I am as a vlogger. But I um, forgot to vlog with that carried away with the food. But um, that is the that is the steak with uh, soy sauce and various other bits on it. Um, pizza. But um, mushroom pizza. That was gorgeous. Yeah, the avocado hummus. So we're probably going to order some more stuff. But if I can be professional enough to remember, I'll vlog it. I can really recommend coming here though. Do you enjoy it? I remember to vlog this bit um, Amy was real excited about um, trying the cake pops after she's seen us have them in September did they come with ice cream last time? yeah, yeah. so when you order it as a main sort of dessert not part of the sampler you come, it comes with two and an ice cream and a strawberry absolutely love it in here and this is more your formal dining area. I mean, look at that table. Absolutely amazing, this place. Well, to me it is. Other people might not think it is, but to me it is. On the recommendation of Scott from The Stranger Couple, we are now entering Twin Peaks. Yeah, we finally made it then. Scott, on your recommendation. Moose. Oh dear. Oh dear. Twin Peaks. During happy hour, that was quite a decent price for the foot, the drinks. The staff were wonderful. Sarah, toilet review. Bless her, she walked in and walked, walked straight I out. Walked straight out, yeah. I've got to find somewhere better to go for a Probably week. not the cleanest. The drinks were all right there. Yeah, the drinks were fantastic. Well, we've got a margarita, which is virtually a pint glass. You've got a Long Island, Island iced tea. Some of you've got a double Jack Daniels and Coke for twenty dollars. So can't go wrong. Yeah. And unlike Hooters, the staff don't look about fifteen. So I think we're going to pop into the world of Disney, Walt Disney Store um, and see if it's improved from our last visit because there didn't seem to be a lot there for the size of the store. We're also going to have a look and see how much an Epcot ticket is because we were going to have a date at Epcot and then we've sort of gone off the idea but um, we'll see how much we can get a ticket for. Obviously with it being Memorial Day we can see it being very expensive 
but we'll we'll go and price it up just for a, a day at Epcot. Oh, she's fit. Where are you going? We do need to get your mother on some form of reins. Just wanders off, don't she? Come on, come on, sweetheart. Oh, bless her. Oh, she's full of fluid and just old. Oh. Well, actually, I don't like that. Yeah. What are you saying? I know, but what you're saying is saying I'm fat. Unbelievably, we've just gone into the Harley Davidson shop and I've walked out empty handed. My choice, there's nothing particularly tickled me fancy in all honesty. You have to just have to dry your eyes. So I'm planning, we're going to go to Disney Springs. So I'll have a look and see what they've got there. Aim wanting to go to Hulk Hogan's, but it's closed. Is it open? It's closed. We'll have to go to the Hulkinator another day. Samuel and Amy are chilling, no, no. Sam, Samuel and Sarah are chilling in the room, so it's just me and Amy are taking advantage of the... Uh, parks are open time as far as I'm aware. It's nine o'clock, Al's Adventure, so obviously with it being um, Memorial Day, so see what we can get on and see what the, the queue times are. See, last time I checked, it's like average is like 10, 15 minutes. Which isn't bad. Quite a lot of people are leaving, so we might Please actually get on something. This is clock. how we do it. Na, 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 na. Okay. Yeah, I'll wait till you, your mother's with me before I get the clock. Spider-Man. Spider-Man. Twenty minute wait for Spider-Man. Let's do it. Our cities, and indeed the nation's greatest symbol of freedom, the Statue of Liberty. 
shown here in police surveillance photos, are the notorious members of this It never seems to age that one, does it? Oh, into the gift shop. Straight through the gift shop. Skip, skip, skip to mother, 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 skip to mother, my darling. minutes for Kong so I think we shall partake of the monkey Big monk. do you love my hair oh I love it thank you so natural you left out that's like the sixth time somebody said to me, I love your hair. I know, I get it all the time. I love your lack of hair. I don't think that uh, person jumps out now, do they, anymore? Uh, oh, God, they do. Miss your grandma. Awesome. Oh, I thought it's, it was awesome. It's like a, one of those rides where I'd be fine if I did do it. Oh, really? Yeah. Look at you, mop. I thought it was awesome. Okay. Awesome. Somebody stank in that line though. Yeah, there was somebody needed a a fresh mint. And I want sure it was in the mouth and needed it. Yeah, it's five minutes for the river adventure, but we don't fancy getting wet at the minute. Uh, like a Simpsons shirt. Oh, I did see it. Like all of the different Simpsons family characters on it. The blue, nice blue. That's the thing. Come on, mine. Lots of coasters still age. So it might be raining, maybe. It's raining. Yeah, I mean, it's about to say hybrid zone, isn't it? I don't know how it's going to Yeah, let's go on that then. Now, doesn't that look beautiful? Favourite part of, of Universal. What is it you, you've seen? No, oh, yeah, I like that. It's cute, isn't it? How much is that? $25. Mm -hmm. $30 for that, though. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> St 
stranger rumours. Yeah. Not all pleasant. I think people come here and they don't really know how to shower. Or well, no, it's hot in here, that's yeah, all. But it's like, there's sweaty and then there's like, and then there's gross. looks so nice when it's all lit up on a night and it's very rare you see it because it's not during the summer and spring it's not open it sort of closes doesn't it usually about seven think, eight o'clock i think they should do what disney does where if you're a hotel guest you get to stay for a couple more hours yeah a late, a late night or even if it was like some benefits where hotel guests maybe last hour and a half hour maybe get expressed or something it's not an incentive to stay stay yeah but i think they might do it maybe with epic opening they might extend hours because they used to be open till 10. Yeah, that's the Aven... Is it Aventura? I'm a fan of it. No, it's Aventura. That's the one with the um, the bar at the top that your man wants to go and it's got a real good viewing area. Yeah, we'll have to go have a drink Maybe when it's a bit later. Yeah. I'd like to see if the treats are so I might get myself a little cake or something. Treat yourself. <laughs> so we've got um, uh, Harry Potter, got a few rides haven't we? Harry Potter, Spider-Man, um, King Kong. Yeah. That's it. Could be alright. Yeah, Universal with the buses, transportation back to the hotels. The, the line, you've got a long line but you've literally got bus leaving, a larger one coming to pick people up, so this queue will be gone in seconds. Very impressed with the uh, bus service at Universal. Ten minutes later. So I am going to have the chicken Alfredo and Amy's having the pasta bolognese. I recommended you the chicken Alfredo. You did, she had the chicken Alfredo, was it last night? Yeah. And it smelled gorgeous and it's real cheesy. I don't think they do a decent choice here, I must admit. <laughs> Gonna to close today's vlog here. Just gonna to retire to the room, have our pasta meals, and then retire to bed. For tomorrow, I think we're gonna do Volcano Bay, hopefully. So, thanks for watching. Please comment, subscribe, and like this video.